guys. Hey, yo, honestly, guys, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. You don't know how much this means to me. Uh, even though 14k is kind of a weird number, I'm just really hyped on like the growth that I've been seeing ever since mainly that I hit 10k and I'm really grateful that you guys continue to watch and subscribe. If you're new here, definitely make sure to do it because I want to start grinding so hard on this channel. I think 2021 can be a huge year for me and I'm so excited for the future. So on with that, just watch like the rest of whatever this video is going to be. So my third reason is I guarantee you, kicking my mama's like. Yo, flip that inside out. <laughs> you got bamboozled. <laughs> Straight up. I don't know anyone who buys the big boys not used. Bro, those would have been like long as hell. Yeah, no, it's a good thing they're hatched. Are these largest? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Pulled up to the park. You already know it's Catoctin for the hundredth time. We actually check the fits. We're like straight, like. <laughs> so I guess in this video, I'm doing a little show off. -y. We're doing, um, uh, I think a Polar 93 denim, that's mine. And uh, big boys like pants overview nice. slash review slash. I already showed it, I think, but yeah. It's like my third time skating them. Film this, Matt. Ready? Switchback heel. I wanted these pants for like a year and never got them though because to get brand new big boys I think is $130 and to get brand new 93 denims is I think around 100 so the only reason I got them is because I got them off Depop and the pants keep their value so well that if you ever kind of don't want them you can pretty much resell them for about as much money as you got them. back at the crib now you can probably tell that I got a new light so uh, in that little intro shot when I was like talking it probably looked like blown out as frick but hopefully it looks decent right now so now I'm just gonna talk a little bit more about these uh, pantaloons it's 93 denim yeah man so you know they got all these tags on the inside some polar some washing instructions i don't know what these are i actually just noticed these there's like ribbons who knows and the guy the little embroider guy little spray paint dupe as you can see these are the mediums which is 
This is a 36, 32, which is large for me, as you can tell. I'm not a huge guy. I'm about 5'11", and I wear 31 waist most of the time. So when I wear these, they do some scrunching around the waist, which isn't a big deal. The belt is mandatory. I don't even think I could shoelace these without it getting really annoying. I think the shoelace would make it really, really annoying. A belt is pretty mandatory, unlike if you get pants that are your size. They do have a size 30-30 in these, but just because of the style right now, and because I like the way it looks when I skate, I like them a little baggier. But jeans feel different than pants like Dickies. Pants like Dickies scrunch weirder. Jeans are thicker. That being said, these are pretty high quality. You can tell they got all the details pretty good in them. Uh, they're durable, they look sick, but at the same time, I figured out these are $110 brand new. Personally, I don't think they're worth that if you buy them brand new. And I don't think the big boys are worth $130 either. Hold up. These are Dickies Double Knee Carpenter Jeans. They. I think are 34, 32. They're darker. I like the way the lighter ones look better, but the build quality feels like exactly the same. And I think these were like $35 brand new, but they don't say polar and they don't have a guy with a spray paint can on them. And those are really kind of all you're getting when you pay that money is a logo. So for me, can't say I would recommend it unless you really want them. I might honestly sell mine. Like if I'll let you guys know if I put them up for sale on Depop or something and I'll sell them for a decent price if I do, but I don't know. Very expensive. I'm trying to think of what else to say about them because they really are just kind of like pants that have just a few added details. It's not crazy. This looks like um like one of those like fat commercials that like advertise like how skinny someone got. I know some of you guys might think my light is weird, this one, mine broke, so that is actually my sister's light. And just in case you noticed. <laughs> All right, one more time, this is what they look like. Yeah, they're just uh, nice baggy-ish jeans. This is what I was talking about with like the scrunch. I take it back, I'm probably not gonna sell them, so if you were hoping that I was, I probably won't, at least for a, a while. You're definitely gonna wanna have to subscribe, that way if I sell them, you'll know. Because I'll tell you. I don't know, that's just me then. Alright, I hope you guys like this video. And if you made it this far, follow my Instagram. Subscribe. Buy some polar pants. See you guys on the next one. Peace out, mates.